where the fans suck heads, eat tail, sing the blues, and know where they got them shoes. Crack open a cold one and get ready for some football. This game is going to be a wholesale slaughter. No discounts in the MFL. The team storm the field. The Carcass City Creeps take on the New Orleans Zombies. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> Grim Blitzrow with you along with my partner, former player Brickhead Mulligan. Hi. And his life partner, the mini mutant head that lives on the shoulder of Bricks Jr. Hey, you just threw up on my shoulder. I don't often drink beer, but when I do, I get totally shit-faced. I am the world's most intoxicated man. Say that again. And it's first and ten. It's two-yard run before he stopped. And that'll be second and eight to go. First down! He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. And it's first and ten. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. And it's first and ten. This guy's going to get mugged in the locker room by his team after the game. Second down and ten. The defender says, I don't think so. Third down and ten. The quarterback passes the ball and it rebounds back. He can't get rid of it. It's like me and these crabs, Grim. Yep, the defense calls a sticky ball dirty trick, and the QB is in a heap of trouble now. <laughs> Time to see if this is an elite kicker. Can he kick through a cement wall? Yeah, probably not, Bricks. Then he's not elite. Straight through the uprights. And if you don't understand why refs are hated even more than kickers, <laughs> well, there's your answer, Bricks. Man, this coach must have often says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. Boring, but smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. He's got the ball now and is going to try and score. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made into dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. Hot <laughs> one. I'm going to say maybe three yards, but a tough three yards. Second down and seven. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. He dropped it. If he does that again, they'll drop him. And that'll bring up third down and seven. 
Hot one, hot two, hey! He sings it in there for a four yard gain. No, they couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. Nice punt. Should move them back nicely. And he's got a chance for a good return here. Oh, it's a punishing hit. And it's first and ten. Maybe the QB should throw it and catch it, too. Second down and ten. Four yards on that one, and he was just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy if that's what you're after. Third down and six. simple game when it comes down to it and it's first and ten and he gets three yards on that run second down and seven Quarterback threads the needle for a first down. And it's first and ten. Oh, with the brain scrambler. Bring up second and one. Like he just ran into the line at the DMV. And guess what, Grim? That line ain't moving. Yeah, that was kind of my point, Bricks. And that'll bring up third and one. Like a two foot putt. You miss two foot putts all the time, Grim. It's good. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. But I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my head, it was a chimp wearing a wig. First and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot. And the defense puts one over on the quarterback with a sticky ball dirty trick. The only thing the QB can do now is run for his life. Or die. That's the end of the first quarter, and it's still anyone's game. Oh, oh, could it be mine? Second down and a lot. Hot, hot one. Hot. <laughs> oh, 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 that gets me every time. I can tell these penalties have really gotten out of hand, especially since they're fake. Go to Dirty Tricks and hit attack ref. It feels good. Yeah. 
second down and a and they've had enough the offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. Hot one, hot two, hey. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. Third down and the punter is warming up. Hot one, hot two, hot. And the quarterback throws a murder ball, which will slice its way through any defensive player trying to block it. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. And it's first and ten. Well, one yard is better than nothing, but not by much. Second down and nine. And he's running like a moose right now. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. Hello now. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot. Guys like a freight train. Nice pick up there for a first down. First down and three. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. Eight. Defense pull and into the end zone with a burst of speed. I think he's warming down this guy to the speed thing, Grim. He's running by the speed. It's clear. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Straight through the uprights. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Yeah, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. First and ten. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. Second down and five. Nicely done for a first down. First and ten. And then it's a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. And it's first and ten. I hope you covered your ears, Bricks, because that was a sonic... He scores! point attempt the kick is good and as expected those are pretty much just gimmies let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty whichever
first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Three. And he'll pick up the first down with a nice piece of running there. down and more than the QB would like. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot eight. And the defense gives up five yards there. And they stop the clock with their first time out to try and stay in this game. Oh, nice coaching move there. Hall of Fame caliber. Well, I mean, it's a pretty standard coaching move at this point of the game. I won't listen to this blasphemy. for a first down. See if they can get something going here. Well, that's two times earned. And you have to wonder, Bricks, are they desperate or are they in control? Yeah, I'm speaking from experience, Grim, but it really is hard to do both at the same time. And I have mastered it. Pass and catch for three. The receiver needs to break some tackles. The quarterback just used his final timeout. Let's see what they come up with on the next play. Second down and seven. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. And into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pass, he was off to the races. See that move, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see it because I'm too fast. <laughs> You know, this should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. Straight through the uprights. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. First and ten. He took a beast boost injection. Now watch him stomp all over his opponents. I want to take a beast boost injection too. And uh, you know, that is weird side effect, Brick. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Uh, I don't think you can say that, Grim. Oh, boy. <laughs> Two minutes of timeout means the QB is playing beat the clock, and he better win. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. First down and one. And the offense quickly calls their second timeout. That's how you do it. Do what? And the hurry-up offense wears out the defense since they can't rest their players. And he 
Snags it for six. Touchdown. Touchdown. because the defense called a time warp dirty trick and transport their offense back in time. It's just a jump to the left. And a step to the right. And he just nailed him right on the numbers for a touchdown. You know, letting these dogs into the league is a slippery slope, Grim. First them, then vampires, then mermaids, then before you know it, we're letting in cat girls. You know, things really start to get weird at that point. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, right. Oh, and the quarterback threads the needle for a first down. The second quarter comes to a close as the teams head for the locker room, and we take you to halftime. Brought to you by Monsatan Industries. We make genetically engineered food that is to die for. It's the start of the third quarter, and we are set to go, Bricks. Oh, boy! Where are we going, Grim? A carnival? Huh? Uh, I'm gonna go into a striptease show. Where are we going? Hey, why don't you settle down? Just pet your rabbit, Lenny. Just pet your rabbit. Hey, okay, no, I can't. Come on, up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. See if they can. The return man catches the ball and heads upfield. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. And it's first and ten. And that's how you run it, folks. Picks up eight there. Second down and two. Crusher right there, folks. And it's first and ten. He rifled that one in there, and they come up with ten yards on the play. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. Caught it! 
And nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self-doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. <laughs> Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. The kick is good. And as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chimp wearing a wig. First and ten. Hot, hot one. Hot. Well, it looks like he wanted to run before he caught it. You gotta keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag. You gotta make that catch. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one. Running like a bull on steroids. That'll be a first down. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. The defense better watch out. The quarterback just threw a murder ball. Oh, I love the murder ball. He refuses to go. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. <laughs> And it's first and ten. A pickup of about three on that play. Second down and seven. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot eight. The defense called a one speed turn and touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders like a greased turkey. Well, this should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. Straight through the uprights. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. First and ten. That's a killer. It was right there, and then he dropped it. Oh, scumbag is killing me in the fantasy league. Second down and ten. Come on! And the quarterback... Way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. And it's first and ten. And that is caught for a first down. And it's first and ten. it for six yards. Good mitts on that play, Bricks. His fingers are like a bunch of sausages. And that'll be second down and four. He dropped it. If he does that again, they'll drop him.
third and four. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. Now there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. It's good. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot. Ouch! What is this, 80s wrestling? Second down and nine. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. And they just popped his eyes into the back of his head. That quarterback can be hurting. Or dead. Or worse. Third down and, well, good luck. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. And then Cats will give them a first down. I don't know if they hit. If you get one more bullshit penalty, you get one more for free. You'll also probably lose the game. Yeah. Just do the attack ref's dirty trick. down in the QB. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. And the ref somehow escapes the onslaught. Here comes the penalty. Third down and, and the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. Third down, and the QB is saying his prayers. Hot one. He had it for a second there. The third quarter has ended, and we'll need a huge rally or a high death toll to make this one interesting. Mm. Oh, here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on here. And he's got a chance for a good return here. Pow! With the brain scrambler! Hey, and it's first and ten. First down! He hit that line the way a rolled up down the bill sticking out a flimsy low hand's nose. It's a mare in lost wages, Nevada. And it's first and ten. He'll pick up seven yards on that play. Second and three. He might have managed to dig out a yard on that one. Not my yard. Got too much buried in, you know, the usual money, bodies, coffee cans filled with, well, uh, you know, mostly coffee. Tastes better, like Eskimos burying salmon heads, kimchi. Fermenting anything really tastes good. 
One time, when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty... They need to call an attack ref dirty trick and stop this, or they're going to lose. Not like they need any help with that. No. These guys are doing fine by themselves. And they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. Now this one's going to be tough. I hope he has a good enough leg for this one. I saw him trying one on before the game. He looked okay, I think. Not my type, though. And it's good. You know, when in this league where murder and bribery are cheered, it's good to be good, huh? I mean, can't we all just... Not this shit again, Bricks. I'm stopping it right there. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company Lukewarm Threads. Their marketing team hates it. And it's first and ten. Not one. And that's a pass that went nowhere. Oh, that's like me at the hotel bar every night. Hey, maybe you need a better opening line than you want to see the teeth growing out of the roof of my mouth? What? The book How to Pick Up Girls and Tell Them Something Unique About Yourself. That's unique. Catch the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. Hot, hot one, hot. They weren't even on the same page on that play. Third and two. Hot, hot one. Talk about Butterfingers, he should have had that one. There's no reason to go for it here, but they do anyway. Well, they kept it on the ground and got a much needed conversion. Much like the well-dressed young men who won't stop knocking on my door no matter how many times I tell them, we worship Satan in my house. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. And that's the kind of play you pay the secondary for. You pay him for the pick six. For this, you just give them a pat on the head and tell them they don't suck. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot. Third down and long. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot. Caught for the first down. First and four. Hot, hot one, hot. The defense calls it a sticky ball dirty trick and the quarterback is in a shit And the defense just knocked the wind out of that quarterback. Second down and five. And he catches it for a touchdown! What a beautiful play! Yeah, it's almost poetic, man! Like a high cool! Seriously, man, you think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? You get my grill, I'll ruin your world. Ruin it.
And these guys think kicking is for pussies, Bricks. They're going for two. Yeah, they got big balls, Glenn. Yeah, bigger than yours. Well, that two-point conversion attempt failed miserably. I mean, that was just terrible. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. And the two-minute warning sounds. They'll have to regroup during this timeout. And it's first and ten. And he the defense calls a sticky ball dirty trick. The quarterback can't dump. Oh, what a sack there. I heard this guy likes to play with soft balls. He's going to play with crushed balls from here on out. The defense calls timeout. He must be trying to get on their QB's good side. Second down in a very lot. First down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly near. The defense is leaving the team with just one timeout. So they better bring the ball back gift wrapped. Is it time for a ribbon or a ball grim? Maybe if they use their last timeout. like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. It sounds like my off season. And that's the last time out. The D has to either break the clock or the offense if they want to win. Hey, as long as something gets broke, right? And that'll be second down and four. He was starting to go somewhere, but he gets stomped after three. They usually stop me after three, too. You know, at the all-you-can-eat buffets, they're not as literal as you'd think. Footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a peck ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Hey, asshole, up here. Talk to the air. And the punter has one job to do, and that's pump the ball. Preferably further. They just let that one drop and play it safe, and the defense says, we'll take it. And the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Brick's match stupsing time. That's why the girls call me Speedy Gonzalez. <laughs> Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. There's a huge gain, and this offense is rolling. Margaret, that was a pass play. Rolling plays are in bowling. Oh, and he intercepts the ball. Thank you very much, Sister Defense. Oh, with a brutal hit. The New Orleans Zombies had their guts and ate them too, and win at home. They come up big today with a solid win, and the opposition will be licking their wounds on the long plane ride home. I heard wounds taste just like chicken. How was it? Scrambles tomato soup. Wounds. Mm-hmm, good. The MVP is about to inspire us with some words of wisdom. Yeah, right. Putting three words together for this guy is like you doing a Rubik's Cube. What's a Rubik's Cube? Moving on. Hey, man, nobody can touch you when I'm off. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about, pal? Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by the Hexon Oil Corporation. We drill it, spill it, and kill it so you...